am a director at General Motors, uh, accountable for data engineering, data governance, and data architecture. And when you just look at how we have to leverage data as it's a fundamental component of the different types of products that we want to create, and you know, really trying to hold true to what we call our zero, zero, zero policy around focusing on where we want to go with our EV market, how we create insights to be able to support those things really requires that we have high fidelity of data that is accessible to the right people, has a certain level of security um, and privacy and trust that's associated to that for not only for the protection of our, of our products that we create, but also protection of our brand and protection of our customers. Privacy first is really our point. If we don't have a very scrutinized privacy component, then we could be putting ourselves at risk or putting our customers at risk. We're really taking a look at the data that's there, making sure that we know how to secure it, we can sure that we know who has access to it, and we're making sure that um, it's at a certain level of quality so um, people can, they can innovate, they can um, create um, awesome new insights, and they can kind of figure out what is the next thing that, we, that we're going to do that's just gonna surprise and delight our customers. I think AI is part of everybody's journey at this point in time. Of course, and the type of data, when you start looking at it from a privacy, trust, reliability, and responsibility viewpoint, those are things that we have to incorporate into our overall uh, kind of like our data governance strategy so we can make sure that how data from the inception, how is that data being leveraged in those AI, AI models? What is coming off of those AI models? What are the different learnings that are coming off of those AI models that are now actually creating more data product? And then how do we kind of infuse that back into the overall ecosystem? So it's kind of like a circle of life from a data aspect perspective within AI. The aha moment for me with the Immuta solution set has been its ability to have different levels of connectors and being able to stitch the data story across all different types of databases. I think the larger the company they, you are, you're gonna have historical or legacy databases and then you're gonna have forward looking and Immuta really does seem to be kind of the the connecting piece of being able to pull legacy and forward together so you have a single view of all of your data assets and how you're going to manage the access around it.